worse than that, it automatically sucked up one of your card slots, so I believe you should have three cards left. Oh, yeah. Good point. Three cards are bad. Now, it's a bit of a walk there. I mean, you don't have to blindfold her now, obviously, but... Right. Um, did you want to just walk there, or did you want to take a ride a peed, which may cause her to lose Sandy as well? No, we can just walk there. All right. You guys walk for a couple of days and whatnot. You notice that about every day of walking, there's like a, kind of a slapped together hotel type thing. They're, they'll eventually become nicer. People are still working on it, whatnot. You guys get free food and lodging pretty much everywhere you go. So that's not a big deal, but it is more comfortable. Eventually you get there, you bird box or you go talk to the air lady, bird box her, and you get them together. Everybody's now sitting in the same room and whatnot. Uh, in addition to you guys is also uh, her sponsor, I guess, who's concerned about her charge. Uh, she's an older lady who's looking after her. Um, this lady that is also bird box, it looks just like, uh, you, you remember in the, the uh, Back to the Future movie where the girlfriend of Marty McFly meets up with the older version? Yeah. Kind of like that. It's definitely an older version of Mildred. There's some subtle changes and stuff, but it's close enough that you're like, God damn. And okay. you're happy to hear them can see each other. So when they're in the same room together, I'm going to burn another charge and see what is happening. Go for it. Lower is better on the analyze magic, by the way. Oh. There's no telling. Neat, you think. <laughs> Mildred door is so cluttered with other shit. It's almost impossible to tell. Mildred, you hear whispering in your ear. You should kill her. I'll um, spend a pause. Because it seems it. kind of important. Oh. No. I then up. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing special, but I got it. There's definitely a link between the two, but what does this mean? What does this all mean? You don't I know. I ask mm. you guys, this must mean something. <laughs> What's that, there, Mildred? I asked the voice why. Why what? Says the other uh, um, lady. Nothing. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> I am too, she says. That's good. So we are all fine and happy here, so we can talk about stuff. Yeah. Okay. I don't want to talk about things, the air lady says. Why? Why do you want me to talk about things? I don't Why are you here, for example? Like, who I don't want to tell you that. Why are you here? <laughs> why? <sighs> okay. The, <laughs> I'm. I'm I they, both, they both begin to get more and more frustrated with each other, Doc. All right, calm down, calm down. We're trying to see, like, what the links between you two are. I, I get them closer together so they're sitting close. Does the, does the connection do anything or no? It gives a weird thrumming. Kind of like if you were to hit a guitar string, how it thrums like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm. Why don't you put your hands out flat? Okay. They both grumble and extend their hands. I slowly like put it so their hands touch each other to see what happens. <laughs> no oh, problem. Boy. Uh, children, give uh -huh. me an essence roll. Lower is better. Ooh, times two. Is that times one? Times, times two. two. Mm -hmm. Okay. The air between their palms as they're getting closer begins to kind of shimmer, Doc. Okay. I continue to push them together. It seems that the air is almost kind of like rippling a bit. Do I feel something? 
Uh, was it like when Janice became one? No, no. Uh, almost kind of like you're trying to push together two magnets that don't want to meet up with each other. Do I feel something? I have a resistance that's slowly building. Can I analyze, like, do spellcraft to see what that resistance may be? To see if they're connected somehow? You can try new analyze magic instead. Spellcraft is yeah, not really. You're not sure, but whatever it is, if they actually touch, it may explode. You're not sure. Should be fun. Continue uh, pushing the hands forward. They're having yeah. trouble actually getting closer. Uh, they, they've gotten about as close as they can right now, and they're both doing the, uh... Is there anything happening, like, around? Like, I'm looking around now, like, to reality. You're going to you're gonna have to go outside of the... Uh, I'll look outside there. the window. Hmm. Looks like um, some sort of localized storm tornado is starting to form over uh, here. Is there uh, anything not... like weird about the storm as well, or what? The rest of the sky is blue, except for over this house, where it looks like a tornado is forming. Da, da, there's a tornado. Da. What? What did you say? Nothing. Also, there's... There's... What's happening? Nothing, don't worry. No, both say it once. Um, the other one's beginning to move her hand back. It's okay. The tornado's starting to dissipate a little bit. Oh, okay. So, what do you remember last? Like, first memory? I was in the hospital. Yeah. And how are you feeling now living here? Why do you ask me this? Because what am I supposed to say? I'm fine. <laughs> Shut up. I'm fine. You are just here. <laughs> Tell me. Bye, she says. Bye. Because... So I, I hold like both of their hands, like and like see if there's like if I can feel a weird link between them or anything. I'm I don't know. I'm I'm trying everything I can think of here. What if you Yeah, go ahead. Feel roll, Doc. I'm awesome at this. Mm -hmm. Oh, apparently I am. You are. No problem. He's got him close. He's going. Mur -mur 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 <laughs> you're not sure why you're doing that, Doc. <laughs> Is it Doc? like a magical feeling or? You're not really sure. Partially. Partially, maybe no. Doc, have you tried drawing a drop of blood from each of them and uh, combining hey, the two hey, drops? What? what? So what? it's starting again because I'm linking them, kind of, or? You're not really sure. Because the storm came back, right? Oh, it never really left. Do I feel something? Like, uh, give me a sick sense danger sense, Yana. Uh -oh. <laughs> no. Fine. <laughs> yeah. I'm used to this. I'm supposed to destroy the worlds anyway. <laughs> what? No, 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 no. Can you stop? Stop with the tornado. Stop. I <laughs> like tornadoes. They are fun. No, they're not. They're going to set you up. I'm trying to summon the witch. <laughs> All right. I... I let, the, I let both their hands go. You don't want to let them touch? No. Or make them touch? No. Are you sure? 
No. Uh, hmm. No, I'm not sure, but I mean, I'll let them go anyway. <laughs> uh, they both put their hands back down. Mm. Plus, Yana wants to slap the other one real quick. We will have fun in a minute. Nice. Um, so, so you, you are just living here? You are like, what, what are you doing? I'm planting the farm potatoes. What? Yeah, planting potatoes? Uh -huh. are, you, are you sure you are me? Like, isn't it boring? Well, if I if I do enough hard work, oh no, more hard boring work, then I don't hear the screaming so much when I'm trying to sleep. Oh, screaming! What type of screaming? A woman screaming, and then sometimes I hear it sounds like a little girl saying "mommy." And I don't want to hear that. I also don't want to hear that. Why are you telling me this? Okay. Um, because so is the little girl trapped somewhere? Is the little girl know. trapped somewhere? I don't know. Why is she asking for mommy when you I hear her? Where is she coming from? I don't know. My head? Right, but when you're dreaming this, is it just off in the distance? Does it get any stronger? When you no. think about the little girl, I do you don't ever? Want to. Don't think I'm... about it. Yeah, why are you asking me this? Yeah. <laughs> right, but see, wouldn't don't you want to help that little girl? No. No. <laughs> they both say. <laughs> Why not? Why? Why wouldn't you want to help your daughter? <gasps> uh, they both go. <laughs> <laughs> As Doc Bolton, apparently his his way of dealing with uh, insane people is make them more insane. And that makes <laughs> them saner. Clearly, this is how it works. It's how it's always worked. That's right. They're both going. Eh. Do you guys want some water? No. <laughs> Not you. No, no water for them either. <laughs> you people. Okay. <laughs> So, hmm. so, so, and you, you hear screaming of a little girl, and do you hear some other screaming too? You said it might be me or okay. you or us. We're all screaming. Why are, we, why are, why what? are you screaming? <laughs> why does, does it have words or is it just like screams? It's just like screams. Why are you screaming? Why? I'm Why? Not screaming! Shut, shut up! Who shut I mean, up? You uh, are who's screaming? It's, it's so is this wrong. just a so Logan? As I'm watching her, is this just basically like a shadow of Mildred then? Um, that was somehow created. It's quite possible. Uh, would shadow lore help with this? Do you have shadow lore? Of course you do. Give me a shadow lore roll. <laughs> Uh, where the hell is it? There we go. Not very good, but I'll give it a whirl. Oh, Where no. Hold on. Mm -hmm. I'm burning a skill five. Why not? Ooh. I'm surprised you didn't check to see if anybody had anything better. Does anybody have anything better? Or actually, does anybody have anything crappy? Because I have an assistant five, too. I have another skill five. If you want one. Oh, I have skill time fiction. <laughs> All right. Why don't you play the skill 10, and I'll give you the assistant 5, and then you can play that on me. Okay. I'll play the skill assistant 5. Yeah. And a fumble. So, well, wow. you know. <laughs> This is because of the Santa Claus. This is Mrs. Claus, who she is expected to marry <laughs> in order to produce elves. Okay. Because somehow she must impregnate Mrs. Claus 
that leaves that up to your imagination. And then Mrs. Claus. I relay all this. Out. <laughs> Both of them would look pretty unhappy about that. Uh, well, um, if you think about it, I mean, yes, Maddie no, was no. made in your, you know, to look like you. So this could work. Um, and she did get impregnated. So once again, this oh. is possible. Why are you talking about this? So instead of having a daughter, then you'll have elves. So you won't have to worry about daughter. A daughter, you'll just have elves, and then they can become your army to take over the world. As you're clearly Mrs. Claus. See, this all it all fits. Mm. We'll just get higher pitch, says the other one. Mm. Mm. <laughs> yeah, this is great. My life is great. This, this is clearly. I want to go back um, to potato. Potatoes. You want me to make you a potato? Ah, uh, uh, the the lady goes. I think we've had enough. I'm going to take her out of here now. Thank you very much. She leads her away. Hmm. Well, this is this is waste of time. The tornado begins to dissipate, or clouds, the proto-tornado clouds begin to dissipate. The lady is taken away. Huh. It all fits. No, it doesn't. I don't know what you are talking about. I don't want army of elves. That's not, like, personal enough for me. I want to destroy the world in much, like, much more craftier ways than to have army of, like... But they're suicide bombers. Didn't you know that? I heard about that. That was nice. I I, yeah. <laughs> I appreciate that. But, hmm. so, so you can have an army of small suicide bombers. I mean, it'll work. Well, but I would. And like, I mean, being your offspring as well, maybe they'll explode into something more exciting than glitter. Oh, and then then all of my offspring would like explode, and I would enjoy that. It does See? Make sense. See, I. There's a method to my madness. Uh huh. I can see that now. Mm. Actually, you can't see shit. You're still blindfolded. <laughs> <laughs> I take it off. No problem. There's nothing here that will cause you uh, uh, any kind of. Oh God, there's no alcohol. Ah. <laughs> okay, so are we of else? It's something to think on, at least. Mm. Mm. Okay. <laughs> the stock Bolton feeds a new insanity into her. You know, you can have enough. Well, that was interesting. <laughs> so, um, I mean, I also saw one of me a while ago in the village. That was an interesting experience. That's different. Villages. Oh. So I wonder if you finally walked pattern, because you haven't walked pattern yet, have you? Or have you? Dun, dun, dun. No. <laughs> if you walked pattern, maybe all of them would come back into you. Yeah. Or be ripped ripped away permanently, because then you would be you, and yeah. all the weirdness would go away. So I think I need to be a little sane. I think so too. <laughs> but it might help you become saner if you were more real. Yeah. That's something to think about too. Mm. Yeah. Maybe you should think about not skinning reindeer. I come on. That's... Eskimos have been doing it for years. I See, mean, yeah, like. But the reindeer were dead. Did you help that? You know, do you really think that the reindeers are enjoying like being the slaves to humans? Killing them is just helping them. I don't know. Have you asked them? What? I Off insult them. him in Inuit. <laughs> <laughs> of course I got it. I knew I used to know Inuit. <laughs> <laughs> A lot I'm of weird like, shit happens here. I'm just like... But, but Actually, see. both of you guys can roll your Inuit language skill to see if you understood what Fulton said. Sure. <laughs> you know. 
Oh, I understand perfectly. Good no, no, yeah. mm. Everybody goes, except for Freddie, he's like, what? <laughs> Apparently the party <laughs> language has become Inuit. Welcome to it. Oh, it used to be too. Was it? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Who uh, the fuck knows Inuit? Nobody. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it, actually, you might want to brief them on party languages because that was an old school trick that the players used. So back uh, in my other life, my past life, we would uh, decide upon a language and we'd all learn it really well that most people didn't know. So that way when we talked to each other, we would just talk to each other in the other language and no one would know what the fuck we were talking about. That's yeah. It's like being from Czech Republic and using Czech language in every other country. Exactly. So, any more weird doppelgangers that we need to visit? Well, the young one's in the cryo tube, so not like that. We can do anything about that one. Yes. Uh, also, well, the... Um, yeah, we could try to, I don't know if I want to do that. Uh, we could try to, like, lure out Maddie somehow. She's killing some kind of monsters in Gotham. Mm-hmm. Gotham is back in the 50s. I is know. Is she even there still? Last time when I was here, she was killing some kind of monsters. Because something with white uh, being something. Um, I yeah. don't know if you want to, in your current state, go hunting monsters. I don't. I don't want to do any of this shit. Okay, I want to go drinking. How about? How about? All right. How about this? Do you like running really fast to avoid being shot by lasers? Um, not really. Oh, come on, it's fun. There's oh, did you want to go look at? Look into some more of the bunkers. Well, yeah, I've been working on my ahem, hacking skills, and I may be able to try and hack into one of them again. That's something I did want to look into anyway, because I would like yeah. to know what happened to the aliens. So I can give it another go, but no promises. Okay, we can do that. Yeah. All right. So I don't need to look up the rules on walking pattern. Um, All right. You never tell what the fucking PCs are going to do. So. um, To alien apocalypse. Aliens. All right. Let's see. That's super easy from here. You go to clubs, different clubs. You go there. Uh, you realize with horror you have no bright yellow armor to put on. Yeah. Oh, is my rifle in the back? In the what? In the back uh, room. In Clems. That's why. Uh, give me a luck and half, maybe. Oh, I don't have anything with me, probably, if. Because nice. I'm. Last time we didn't have anything with us. Perfect. <laughs> uh, it appears that somebody uh, has stolen. Uh, wait, no, you haven't rolled it yet. There it is. Ah, uh, somebody stole some other box of like uh, the rubbing alcohol that Clem uses on the, the combs or whatever to po- probably drink, but your rifle's still there. Okay. Um... There's a lot of fluids in here, bad fluids. Guys, do you mind if I just pop over to uh, the Australian Embassy and leave this there? I don't want to lose this. It'll be two minutes. Hurry, go. Uh, I'll go do that real quick. Done. Uh, you, you leave it there. there. It shows, like, all these rifles and stuff. No problem, yeah. You, you toss cool. it in there. All right. Um, so I'm back now with the others. Hey, yep. um, do either of you know what happens to your equipment when it mysteriously disappears? You know, you just wake up and it's not there anymore? It just no. 
Nope, not right, not so much with the armor. <sighs> I guess you should have. And... It's Actually, probably you, you might know where it is, Chris. That's for Chris to think back on, not character role, because it's happened a number of times to different people. I also lost my hacking computer. Not the one we built, but my normal one, so. Oh, well, whatever. It's probably anyway. like in whatever home or like that you keep most. That's usually where the shit it goes. As far I as mean, I know. It's, it's not in the Australian embassy. Last time I checked. So, uh. Mm. I'll check in the other places, but... Are you going to check in the other places now or later? Uh, not right now. We have other stuff ah, to do. Okay. <clears throat> First, we need to introduce her to the guards and show her the cartel house, and then They've we can got... go out there. Welcome to the post-apocalyptic wasteland. It's kind of like the Mad Max thing where everybody's all rock, guard up and stuff, and they're introducing you around. This is Bruiser. This is Crusher. This is Killer. This is Little Crusher. This is et cetera, et cetera. And a bunch of like, arr, arr. and they're all very respectful toward these guys because apparently they're the Spice Cartel. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, we have the look big gag. Did it be here? They, they look at Freddy like, I didn't hear anything about lockpicking. They don't have like, yellow armor on, or if they don't have yellow armor, they have yellow shirts. Only one dude that has yellow armor. The Everybody else has yellow shirts, man. Yeah. <laughs> They're trying hard. They want a uh, uniform. She's, um, want. she's an associate of ours, so just let her in whenever. Different gang. Allied yeah. gangs. We got allied gangs. They fist bump each other, <laughs> headbutt each other. It shows like it shows a couple of them fist bump, a couple of them headbutt, a couple of them kissing passionately. And you're like, all right. <laughs> so yeah, I'll um, I'll show her around. So we have a little. What a shit a little... you're thinking, Mildred. First, there's no supplies of alcohol. Second, it looks like just uh, uh, have you ever been to one? Oh, there's a lot of scratchy, scratchy from yeah. somebody. There's. Uh, have you been to one of those really shitty flea markets before, where it's just like people are selling junk type flea yeah. markets? It looks like everything was bought from one of those and then put onto some rickety ass tables and shit, and then put about twenty guys who don't bathe in the room with it Great. and uh, have them work out a lot. Um. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking horrible. The beds look like uh, bird nests gone bad. Um, Why are yeah. we here? I mean, it's a nice place. It's There's no trees what and no water. Oh, I would kill to live in a place like this, says Bruiser. Oh, wait, See? I do. I do. Aha! <laughs> <He says>. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you make friends with people like this? Ah, says Bruiser. If you were a part of the Lockpick gang, I would never condone this behavior. You know, this is a big step up because when I was young, we used to live in like a kind of a pieces of a house. Oh, you had a house, isn't there one? Yeah, luxury. We used to live in a, a hole in the street. And everyone's like, hole in the street? Now, we, we used to dream of a hole in the street. We lived inside of a septic tank. Every day it would fill up, and then we had to lick it clean. <laughs> great! You have great friends here. <laughs> They're great, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> the big burly men all look very happy to be complimented. Uh, some of them have. Uh, there must be a good 30, 40 teeth between the eight of them. Mm. <laughs> so yeah, I'll um, mm -hmm. I'll show her. Around the workshop. He, he walks you. It shows him walk you around. It's it's like kind of a biggish open area, but it literally takes like sixty seconds. It's like that over here. We have the, hey, watch you back in here. <laughs> what a great like. I mean, for here, this is fucking luxury. Everybody else has much shittier places. This is luxurious for here, but you're thinking, right? Yeah, not so, a lot of uh, privacy. And I think you're the only female 
here. Mm -hmm. They apparently said, we want to hire the biggest, meanest, ugliest people possible. Right. And we went with that. Mm -hmm. But there are have you been here before? No. You need cards then. Have you been to post a post apocalyptic alien thing before, Yana? Yes, but no. Oh. Okay. Oh wait, uh, let me check see if it's been revitalized. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. So. Um, I would yeah. like to. There's still parts for two um drones with cameras on them. I want to try and make them real quick. Okay. Give me electronic repair, and uh, then uh, if you make that, you can try the, your craft drone skill. Oh, great. Okay. <laughs> Yana, do you want to help with this, or do you uh, want to watch? What do you need? Uh, well, basically, hold this wire and these. I'm terrible, I'm terrible at holding wires, but I try. Give me electronics roll to support Yana before he rolls. I don't support. But. All right. Okay. She is terrible at holding wire. She was not kidding you. So, so I have two of them. Is this for both or for one? Uh, this, this, uh, the electronics will be for both, uh, okay. unless you'd rather have it per. I don't care. Do, are you good at I figured you were good at electronics, so it's just going to I'm, I'm decent. It's not the best, but yeah. Can you do it as a living? All right. You trash all the parts and blame uh, it on it. Yeah. Yeah, fuck these parts. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I wouldn't. It. I wouldn't. Unless you got really? reroll card. Well, I oh, yeah, spend pause on, spending pause yeah. on drugs that cost like $200. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ask Yana if she thines that's a good idea. Look at her face. She's yeah, like, what no, are no. you thinking? I mean, All sure, right, this fine. could be a gunshot you're deflecting, but. I'm going to give the broken pieces to the gods and be like, hand this out as present to people. Uh, yeah, they look at it like, all right. And uh, right, they, they, they get the people to form a line and then uh, they're coming with their bags and then like uh, one, one gets a thing in the bag and then they go to the next guy who hits them really hard in the gut and then uh, the next guy comes with his bag and he gives them a part and then the next guy hits them really hard in the gut and he's like, oh, thank you. Uh, I like this. <laughs> she watches uh, as they, and uh, the second guy's like, oh, oh. <laughs> right, they just keep doing that. And you're not sure why they're beating the people after giving them stuff. They just want to have fun. <laughs> uh, well, the, the computer is still here, right? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, it's underneath that cloth over there. Okay. Well, I don't want to go yet without Doc. So, Mildred, do you want to... Is so there anything you need? <laughs> do you need any equipment or anything from the uh, bazaar? Um, I don't think I really need anything. I'm a minimalist. I don't need things. Where are we going anyway? Like, oh, we... well, there's, there's this alien bunker with uh -huh. like lasers that will come out and shoot you if you go too near but inside they have all sorts of weapons and armor and computers and so, yeah so it's more about like evading there are uh, it's basically me turning off the defenses and us three running fast enough before they come on again okay i don't need anything to run like, one, of, one of the uh, bruisers, uh, the one named Bruiser, actually, he says, uh, Sir, you're not going to bring guns here, are you? Oh, no guns. Oh, oh, thank goodness. You notice that all of them have, like, uh, kind of medieval-ish weapons, but yeah. they're all made from other because, stuff. Like, yeah, you know, I know. Stuff. I remember that guns are supposed to be here. Yeah, I don't know what you remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, I don't know when you were last here, but the... Big alien spaceship. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's gone now. Oh, okay. And yeah. how, how does the city work? Is it uh, let me show you around. Okay. I'm going to the big crater in the ground and all that. 
Yep. Uh, he takes you over to, you remember where uh, zone one was kind of the outer zone where they yeah. did trading and stuff. Zone two was like the pregnant women mm -hmm. who, and then zone three was the, you have to have a fucking neural bomb. Zone three is now flat ground. Okay. It just, it looks like somebody said, I want to scrape the uh, top three inches of, or 30 centimeters of dirt off of here and then leave nothing there in an exact circle. Mm-hmm. And then fly fly it away on our spaceship and just leave. Mm. And they did. Why did they leave though? Ah. That's what we're hoping we'll find out if we manage to uh gain access to the computers in the bunker. Ah. We tried last time, but it was way too hard. Interesting. Okay. Do you do you speak alien? Um <laughs> Oh, uh, no, I, yeah, a little, little bit, not very much. Okay, that might help. Yeah, it's, yeah, not a big chance, but I know some words. Okay. Um, Did you ever, Yana, see the, the, the uh, cryo tube thing? Yeah. Know that the language you know is the same one as that was in the cryo tube area. Just that point. Ah, okay. So there might be different alien language. <laughs> yes. Oh no, I'm saying it's it's the same, which is oh, like, right. you're like oh, freaky. Yes. Mm -hmm. so, so while we wait for, oh, go ahead. Yeah, I, no, I was just thinking that 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 was in a different. Okay. Yes, totally different zone. <laughs> yeah. Everything seems just... to be connected. That's Can it. I just like, I want to just explore the local area. I want to see what is the state of medical services slash supplies that's um, in this area. Uh, for ring two, it's they've got some, but the, their supplies are rapidly failing. For ring one and beyond, you're guessing the words non-existent. Good. I mean. Oh no, poor people. They have no medicine. <laughs> He's so mean to them. Oh. I'm not mean, I'm just uh, establishing the needs and wants of the people. Right. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, I mean, uh, the, there are several problems with medicine, like uh, I don't think Freddie knows anything about medicine. No, no, not really. Or, bargaining or appraising or i just meant like we could potentially bring in antibiotics painkillers drugs of various sorts to help you, with you could the problem is, is that they really don't have much that i think you need um i mean you don't need a uh a stop sign that's been changed into a shield really badly well, they have uh they have lots of cool tech stuff don't they Ring two has a little bit. Most of the tech seems to have left with the aliens. Can I have a look? Like generally speaking, what kind I mean, of tech do they have? You've got a you've got a tent of cool tech that you got. Yeah, yeah. Price. I mean, like, do they have another compu computer I can buy potentially? Hmm. Uh, give me a luck roll. Lower is better. I don't mean like the one they have now. I just mean like a normal. A laptop kind of thing. Uh, look. Fumble. None exist. All right, fair enough. So, well, the thing is, the more stuff we bring to this area, the more we'll be respected, and the more favor we can garnish for when we do need something. So it's kind of a investment into the future. Kind of a thing. Into the future. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Bye bye. Uh, is there anything you wanted to check out? Yeah. Uh, no good. Not really. I was here like last time. I was here. It was like a long time ago. So I I'm not sure what is going on here but now. Do you know Doc is gonna have a child? What? Yeah, mm. the lady he was with. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, Doc. Good Doc, see don't wander up. He looks at you suspiciously. They, Doc, when you walk up, they both get real quiet real fast. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so, Doc, I have yeah. an idea. Oh, sure. I know we don't need much more from this area, but more favor and more respect that we have could be useful. So I was thinking, since you're the doctor and you know about medicine, what kind of drugs and antibiotics can we bring to this place? I'm sorry, that broke up a little bit. Try Say that again. What kind of, what kind of drugs and medicine and stuff? And stuff do you think these people would need? Because I, I had to look around. Like antibiotics been, and like yeah. just vitamins in general would be good for these guys here. But it's yeah, something that they would see a lot of immediate like comebacks on. So to them, it wouldn't seem like, because like, are you looking for other trade goods type thing? Yeah, more trade so we can establish an even better reputation as the supply guys. Mm -hmm. Just an idea. But um, while you ponder on that, did you want to check out the bunker? Sure. Okay. Um, I'll go grab the computer and head on over there. You guys head over to the bunker. It's our whatever walk outside of the city. And you get back to the, the safe zone. It's pretty clearly delineated around here. Some guys made a field right up to the edge showing how clever he is. Um, looks like the field's overgrown. Like maybe he forgot that he shouldn't walk an extra step. But um, yeah, it looks like there's like laser blasts and stuff. And it looks like a long, a big radius around this, like several sprinting rolls and whatnot uh, if, to try to get to it. Uh, it seems to just be a white uh, pillbox type thing, like kind of a it, big white rectangle with a blast shield type deal. Has it, has the radius grown larger since last time? No. Okay. It's always been pretty goddamn big, which makes it inconvenient and more dangerous because that's how we like it. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All right. Um, so we need to open the doors turn off the defenses, and then run inside, then do the same thing on the way out. It's not safe, but it could be potentially very rewarding. I would like to point out the computer type thing that he has is essentially a backpack with some antennas and stuff. It looks like it's been pieced together from old world junk. It looks pretty goddamn delicate to you. And he's got like, it's on his back and he's got like this keyboard thing that's kind of on a thing around him. and he, little screen stuff's got a crack in it. And he's like, yeah, we can do this. And you're thinking, ah. All right. Well, uh, if no one has any assists they want to play, or help <laughs> me with the hack. I don't know anything about this. So. I can. Can I? Uh, can I assist Logan? You can look over his shoulder and scream uh, patriotic sayings into his ear. But I, I can't like assist with hacking at all. You you, you could, but you've never done it before. Uh, I don't know if you know the alien language and stuff or whatever. Basically, he's just writing programs and hoping they work. Rather he than the, can I can I try to uh, do the alien language thing? Yes, yes, sure. Uh, Yana, go ahead and give me the strange alien language. Chris, go for the hacking assist, and uh, then we'll see if uh, Freddie gets some help. No, because the alien oh. language is the future prison language, right? Correct. Um, also, since I've done this before, oh yeah, I'll give uh, you a plus five for having done it before. Okay, cool. 
plus five. That's the other thing. Hit, hit, hit the power pellet. <laughs> Eat the ghosts. Eat the ghosts. <laughs> All right. So <laughs> the defenses go up, I suppose. So now we need to open the doors. Uh huh. Well, I mean, you don't have to. Well, I mean, you know. Yeah. Uh, plus five to this as well, or? Yes. Eat the ghosts, I'm telling you. Hmm. 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 Right. Everybody give me a sprint roll to make it there before the doors close and defenses come back online and shoot you to death. Done. Mm -hmm. I was going to say, uh, everybody's really good at sprinting for some reason in my campaigns. Mm -hmm. I wonder why. Mm -hmm. You guys get oh. the building. Um, there's all kinds of uh, different uh, boxes of shit in here. Can you tell them what's in the building? Because I kind of forgot in there, Freddie. Uh, there was um, the the yellow edit armor, just a bunch mm. of it. Right. There were some jacks, some right big, uh, big plastic black yeah. jacks. They look like what little kids play with with the ball, and they bounce it and try to pick them up. And there was just doing that. A <laughs> bunch of the uh, there was just I, a bunch of strange alien weapons that we couldn't identify. And that mm. was it. Oh, and the okay. uh, there's Computer pistols well. and there's rifles and there's armor and then there's uniforms mm -hmm. and there's a bunch of and then the jacks and then a bunch of just crap we didn't know what the fuck was yeah there you go yeah so i don't know if you want to grab a pistol or two just to have obviously hide it in your backpack or something um but yeah i'm gonna try and Go over to the computers, and since my hacking has increased since last time, I want to uh, try this again. I'm going to try to assist, and like, because I'm hoping that if we can patch this into that computer, that like we can translate somehow. Well, uh, first, in order to do the hacking and stuff, um, because you're not going to know if you're in unless you understand you're in. All I need is a simple alien language role, just to let him know if he's in. Otherwise, he just does the dramatic typing oh. from movies and stuff. Let and me that... play my assistant five. Oh, you. On who? On um, Doc. I'll play and my she's skill nearly, five. She's nearly fluent in the language. I'm not sure. No. Oh, come on, work with me here, damn it. Oh, uh, what? I made it. Oh, yeah, did you? I didn't yeah. put my skill modifier in. You bastard. All right. Well, apparently you backed the right proverbial horse. So um, now you can go ahead and try uh, the computer use role. If you make the computer use, then you can try the hacking role. Okay. All right, come on. It keeps yelling, eat the ghost for some reason. I assist. Oh. Yeah, okay. Well, why did okay. I was let you done that, but okay. Fine. No, no, you're the computer guy. Mm-hmm. He's the doctor. She's the mental patient who's escaped from <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Right. You got the computer working. Now, uh whoever wants to assist him with hacking, roll that before he rolls his hacking. I will assist the hacking. Yeah, I'm not really sure what Mildred does. She just drives plot. I'm not sure what her role in the party is other than driving plot. <laughs> Bots, so I'm assuming plot. Mildred does want to help, okay. I don't know anything about hacking. I can try to... I'll teach you one day. I have a skill okay. five if it'll help. Every bit helps. All right, so I will play it and just trade me one of your junk cards. Okay, I would like uh, to say it had been funnier if Doc Fulton had supported and he had like a 90-something skill 
And he's like, here you go, buddy. Here's your plus five. And you're like, the fuck? And he's like, I don't know that much about computers. You're the computer. <laughs> it's happened in the uh, past. Mm-hmm. All right. So plus five. Let's do this. It looks like a super complicated system to infiltrate. Bye, Hoth. Nice. All right. Yeah, you guys are in. Uh, what do you, you're, you, you pretty much got access for a while until the, uh, if you'll recall, there is some sort of uh, primitive AI, and right now it's trying to figure out what's going on. You're not sure how long you've got in here. So good luck. First, what do you want to do? Well, first things first translator so that way we can that's not something we need to worry about anymore oh, okay uh right he, he enables the translator so that yeah good good call there take card back enable online translator would you like uh uh voice it asks yes yeah. sure okay cool it now talks to you um is there any way for me to set up a back door so that if we ever need to come back, it will be a lot easier for us? Are you asking the computer or are you asking the GM on that? The GM. Ah, right. Um, because of the primitive AI that is working to uh, thwart you, you could try, but uh, it may end up finding and destroying it. Pretty much, uh, if you want to make a one that can't be found, it'll be a very hard hacking roll. Uh, they play uh, a lot of uh, cool music, and it does the slow panning around him shot while he's like. All right, let's just find what we need, and then we'll worry about. He goes like, and he turns off the computer and looks at you. Goes, can you not? No, it's a fumble card, Logan. I'll spend a pause. What? No, I was happy with that. I'm sure you were. Yeah. Ruin Logan's book. The look Are on his face. Like, now? What What's up? Are you sure you want to do that now? Don't you want to find the information first and then do the back door at the end? I thought you were wanting to make the back door. That's why I was supporting you. That's why I made okay. the roll. Because that's what you wanted okay. to do. He's only, he's only at a negative 10 when you're supporting him. So. Zero. Right. I'll do the back door or try it. Good to. luck. Hey, if you're not making it by half, then no good. Super hard. Half is barely a success. Quarter is better. Critical. Critical. Is- <laughs> All right. So you, <laughs> right, you are now, uh, uh, you three are now recognized. Just you three are now recognized, authorized users of uh, the uh, bunkers. And in fact, all of the bunkers since you made your crit at half. So uh, you, you make a note uh, that you three can pretty much walk into any bunkers. If you have guests with you, that's fine, as long as they're with you. And your face and stuff can be clearly seen so it can recognize yes. you. Oh, you guys sorry. are now authorized, happy users for this. The AI is like, oh, I didn't say so. Oh, 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 that kind of thing. I, I want to <laughs> look up the fu- my file. Right. Um, give me a computer u- or research role. Research role. I'm gonna help him. Okay, role to support his research. Yana, would you like to yell communist uh, um, uh, slogans in their ears? Yes. Nice. <laughs> give me one, Yana. Just one from your uh, old school days or something that you remember. I need to play this. The no. Oh, it's yeah. I got it by 30. Hold on, I hear Yana's communist slogan real quick. <laughs> I don't remember that much like communist slogan. I was four years, four years old when the revolution happened. Well, yes, but I'm sure they taught you it in school. Well, it's always about like how the, the workers are the best and like you have to work a lot and that's, that's like, that's the great thing. Cool. Got it. Right. You find uh, file, uh, Fulton, James, doctor. Um, 
essentially uh, it shows him uh, having been given access to some of the highest uh, security clearance things, much of his files redacted. It does have a warning uh, that uh, in the um, personality thing that according to his personality testing, uh, he may be psychotic. Um, yeah, it, it also they, they think that he was um, uh, some sort of spy, but he, his work was so goddamn good, they decided to keep him on staff anyway. They tried watching him, but then he would disappear for periods of time and they wouldn't know where he went. Uh, but yeah, he's highly trusted. Uh, part and also it, it does uh, uh, give the serial number of the cranial explosive that he was implanted with. Um, Wait, what? Hold on. That, what yeah. is this? It doesn't. It's gone. It doesn't matter. It's gone. You, you sure? I got rid of it. It shows a picture of Doc with mirrors and stuff and goggles. Okay. Um, yeah, it, it, I, Doc was working on uh, various uh, classified projects and such for the aliens. And in fact, it even uh, uh, says he had a uh, meeting with uh, apparently one, one or more of the aliens at one point. Uh, it doesn't list their names or whatever, just lists various numbers and stuff like that for identification purposes. Um, he just, he, this whole file makes him look like some sort of evil, mad scientist guy that the aliens uh, hired. And the doc's looking at like, oh, that was fun. I remember that. Oh, that was nice. Oh, yeah. And uh, they say such nice things about me. <laughs> oh, yeah. It, it definitely looks shady as far. It's like going through a. Uh, uh, Dr. Frankenstein's uh, uh, files, but, you know, if they're done by aliens and shit in the future. This does uh, not make me feel better about the doctor at all. At I mean, all. I, I didn't feel good about him in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> you you were right in that, yes. Um, any information on when, no, not when, where and why the aliens left? Mm, all right, you sweep aside that and you uh, do some more research. Research roles, if you're interested. <clears throat> God damn, he adds a plus 10 to your research there, Freddie. Yana, would you like to help with the research, or are you just going to stand no. there and have the camera look at you for a reaction shot from time to time? I just knew I wouldn't make it. So. Ah. <laughs> No problem. Uh, those uh, are apparently all redacted or classified or some such. I'll spend one point on that. Are you sure? You're, I'm you're, sure you're it's still... important. Hold on. Ask ask Chris when it's an important time to spend hero points. Is it important, Chris? <laughs> really? I think so. Well, I, we all want to know, and it's a big mm -hmm. thing. That's not okay. what we came for. Okay. All right, I'm done. Not, yeah, whatever. All right, you're spending another one? No, no. Perfect. One's enough. Yes. Apparently, those records are all classified, redacted, who knows what. Ah, 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 I told you you shouldn't have spent a hero point. <sighs> I mean, maybe one of the other bunkers has information, but. <sighs> Actually, I wouldn't mind going. Like, can we find out where the that one bunker is that, that I worked at is? Oh no, that was in deep space, dude. They 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 brought you to the desert, but then when people were sleeping, according to your file, you were actually taken to one of the asteroids and such. Can we pull up a map of where all the bunkers are? Give me a research roll. Dun, 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 d